Hey everybody, welcome back to another video from Breezy Organization. Today we are just going to be doing a little bit of decorating. So um, I haven't planned my next week yet and I'm actually early. So by the time you're watching this, the week that I'm planning is going to already be done. But I got so excited about these stickers and I couldn't wait to play. Uh, so I got these stickers a little early and so we're going to go ahead and do a planning page. So so right now it is March the 25th. So I'm going to click on March 25th and this is what I have for right now. I couldn't release this video before now because I'm using stickers that won't be released until after this whole week was over. So um, I'm going to be using some of our spring scene stickers that just got released. So I'm going to click over here on spring scene and I'm going to click on this gorgeous bookshelf. I think this is the one that I want to use. I'm going to do this one or the trees, but I'm going to just, um, but I'm going to grab this and then I'm going to go over to my page here and I'm going to see what I can do. So I don't know if I want this to go halfway off of the page, which is normally my style. So I'm going to hit crop, bring half of this down. So I really love this sticker. It is definitely my favorite out of this scene sticker pack volume two. Um, but in the back of my head, I really wanted to use the girl with tulips and it takes me a while to get to that conclusion. So after deleting the bookshelf or bookstore one, I added in the trees, cropped them down some to have them going off just off the right hand side of the page. I wanted the taller part of the tree. So you'll see there that I cropped that off, but it's still not exactly what I wanted. So here I go. I'm going to go grab the girl and I'm going to try her because this is one of the favorite stickers that I had out of this week and I was just dying to use her. So um, I wanted her coming off the left side so I just moved everything over on the right and here I've just added a quote, happiness looks gorgeous on you. And then I clicked on the image tool, clicked on crop and freehand to take out that bottom left square. Um, so I've got a big, nice space to put happiness looks gorgeous on you down at the bottom corner. Next, I'm adding in a background sticker from I believe April background stickers. They're tulips and arrange them to the back. Next, I clicked on the star icon, which is your elements feature in GoodNote 6. And anytime I have a checklist or font pairings that I love, I save them for um, easy, quick planning in the future. And so that's what I've done here. I've changed it to a color that I want and copy and paste. Next, I actually use actual fonts for this weekly spread instead of stickers um, because these font stickers were not released yet. We do have the numbers available now, but here I changed the color of them because um, I... I don't have a weekly color background this week and I felt like I needed to add tons more color because I didn't have all the color pop. Next thing that I'm doing is adding a main icon for appointments and events that are going on on that particular day. So one main thing on each day along with my checklist at the bottom. Um, so next I'm finding out a font pairing that I want to use. I decided to use, I believe, Traveler for the top, which I think says trailer on Good Notes, but it's actually called the Traveler font. And then on the bottom, I used, I want to say California Paradise is what that font name is called. I love these dashed lines. I'm definitely not getting over those anytime soon. So I'm adding those pointing back to each sticker. And then I have three colors that I'm going back and forth on this spread. The blues, the pinks, and the yellow. I guess four, dark blue and light blue. Um, so the iPad and the Mac comes from, I believe, a work at home sticker pack. The um, clothes hanging comes from a shopping or girls day sticker pack. The girl in the top left with a book and holding coffee um, is from the April 2024 sticker pack along with this uh, pickleball is from April 2024 and the Easter eggs are from March I think 2024 um, if I remember right that's where they're from and then this um, tomb here is from the Easter 24 sticker pack. And I think that's most of the stickers that are on this page. Um, oh, this one did come from a lake house, I think, boho or a lake house sticker pack, the little clothespin. So I love the way that this set turned out. I'm just making a few finished touches and then I have to add something for my menu. Some weeks I find that I wanna track a lot of things and other weeks that I know I'm gonna be super busy, um, I've gotta focus on what I've gotta focus on. And this week we've got several appointments and meetings and different things that I have to go to um, that I've added in extra even writing um, that you'll see at the end. Um, so here I'm just finding an insert. I needed the dark insert and I just took off weekly menu because I know what that's going to be. Okay, here's a look at how my week turned out for this week. It um, was a little challenging getting in the groove this time. So sometimes 
it just doesn't work out. I wanted to start with the decorating and I just had trouble decorating today, but I ended up loving how it turned out. I got all of my checklist and we're getting to have more and more appointments. Um, but I have got all of my appointments, all of my to do's added in here. All I have left is to put in my weekly menu, which I'll sit down with my husband and plan for, um, this weekend sometime. So thank you so much for watching this. I hope you guys got a little bit of inspiration and some different ways that you can plan. Um, and if you like to see anything more, we've got tons of videos here on YouTube. We are very active on Instagram and our Breezio family group on Facebook. So definitely join those outlets if you're interested in Breezy organization products and how all of our customers use them. You'll get some great inspiration along with great help for anything that you may be struggling with. So thanks for watching and until next time, happy planning.